Hey guys, what's up? It's Dana. Um, this week we're answering a question from one of our viewers. The question is basically, how does it feel for us to be on the internet talking about um, body positivity um, when there are other blogs and websites that basically tell people that thin is in? <laughs> thin is in, I guess. Um, the other people this week have talked about thin spell. I'm not really I've never heard of Thinspo before I've watched everybody's video this week um but I do think that especially after hearing about this these Thinspo blogs I think that it's very important for us to talk about the topics that we talk about um I think that these topics that we 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 speak on are very important for people to hear um different people's struggles um throughout life with their weight and just different experiences that they um, that have occurred in their lives, uh, while also trying to stay positive and um, realizing that you know you're beautiful. It doesn't matter your pant size; um, that you're still a beautiful person. Um, so I think I think it's very important for us to continue to have vlogs like this. I actually get more inspiration when I hear of things called thinspo. Um, because I really honestly think that children need to hear all different sides. Um, and I think, especially in the world that we live in today, especially in the USA, where, you know, all you see on TV is is skinny, thin women. And, and it seems like any time that somebody is skinny, thin, it's like, oh, she's so attractive. And then when somebody is a bigger person, that... It's not looked on like as, as, as it being as attractive and then being as attractive. And I think that's very, it's important for people to understand that you can be beautiful at any size. Um, in my opinion, somebody that is on a thin spo blog and is preaching that skinny is, is important, it's important to be skinny and, you know, you're more attractive if you're skinny and whatnot. I honestly feel like I wish they would watch a blog like this, um, and just listen to all of the different stories that are had and, and different um, topics that are talked about. Um, I don't want to come off as, as sounding judgmental, but to a certain extent, I feel like those are different disorders. These people have disorders. If you think that you can only be attractive if you're skinny, I think that you have a disorder of... Um, of some sort. <laughs> um, I, I actually I have a coworker who is a very skinny is this very skinny woman. She's twenty six. I think she's like one hundred and five pounds. She's I want to say five three or five four, and she's obsessed with the fact. She's obsessed. She feels like she should weigh a certain amount, and it's because of different things that have happened in her her life. Um, that she feels this way and people telling her that she's more attractive when she's skinny. And like I said, I think that it's important for people to see blogs like this because it's sad that in 2013 people still feel this way. Um, I'm that person that wants to debate you down when I hear things like this. I just don't think that she is healthy um, just because she barely eats and she goes to the gym every single day and she's gone to the gym, she's gotten bloody noses and she just pushes herself to the point where she shouldn't lose any more weight. It wouldn't be healthy for her to lose any more weight. But she feels like she'd be prettier if she was thinner. That That is, like, mind-boggling to me. Um, I, I would hope that none of my siblings would ever feel that way. None of my friends would ever feel that way. And that's why I feel like it's important for us to do videos like this. I think it's important... For us to share our experiences about how we look, how we feel, our our sexual orientation, I think that it's, it's very important for people to see this positive energy, this positive website talking about be who you are. It's important to be who you are. You're beautiful. Um, you're a beautiful person, and just because you aren't a size zero, two, three, whatever, that you're not beautiful. I think that it's important. So. When I, when I hear of something called Thin Spot, I actually am happy that I'm doing what I'm doing. I want to keep doing it. I want to keep things positive. Because um, it's needed. 
I think kids need to see. You know, look at these people. Um, they look like me, and they're happy um, the way that they are. So, yeah, that's my, my spiel. I have gone over five minutes, and I've tried not to. Ah! But I hope everybody has a great week. I am about to go to my sister's baby shower. So, you guys have a good one. Bye!